I can't believe the Piper Squad isn't embarrassed that this is the third, probably fourth video I've made about them. And yet they continue starting unnecessary drama and making it hard for them to beat those allegations. You know, I keep mentioning how the entire Piper Squad is a danger to society, but I can confirm now that Piper Raquel herself is the problem. Not me saying it as if we didn't know already. No, for real you guys, I feel like there's something wrong with this girl. And the only person to blame for Piper's actions is her family, of course, specifically her own mother. I think we all know the reason why. Yeah. Not only does her mother exploit Piper for money and views, but she even forces her into faking relationships and friendships on the internet just to get people talking about her. Also, let's not mention how her mother is literally a predator that hasn't been investigated yet. Anyways, let's move on. In my previous video about the Piper Squad, we had a discussion about all the controversies the Piper Squad has been through, including Piper's own mother, Tiffany, who literally made out with a freaking child. And aside from this, we also talked about how Piper Raquel herself lives in a very toxic environment and how she sets unrealistic beauty standards to her young fans as well as taking zero COVID safety measures. But now that we have an idea of how problematic Piper and her family really are, I don't think I've ever mentioned Piper's relationships with her past partners and close friends because y'all, they are just rough. I wish I was exaggerating y'all, but that's literally the truth. Piper is one of those popular girls on the internet who struggled with most of her relationships. And to be honest, I still don't understand how a 13 year old has been in multiple relationships. Like girl, chill. You literally just got out of the womb. <laughs> So, hey, we're not here to drag this poor girl, well, for the most part, yes, because we're gonna be talking about how Piper ditched her friends after cheating on her boyfriend. Since I'm not super familiar with Piper and her messy relationships, I'm gonna make this very short and simple. Because, apparently, Piper used to allegedly date Lev Cameron, or I think their fans thought they were dating. The main reason why I'm saying this is because their relationship was known for being so complicated on the internet, since not only did people accuse Piper of cheating on Lev multiple times, <laughs> but their energy together just seemed so off since the majority of her fans had a feeling that Piper was still in love with her ex-boyfriend, Gavin Magnus. It all started when Gavin went on Instagram Live all of a sudden to announce that he has a new unknown girlfriend. After he left his fan base in shock with his new announcement, a lot of people started wondering who his new girl could possibly be. And, ah! Uh, she turned out to be a TikToker called Ava after Gavin himself officially announced her publicly. Now, here's where things start. After I investigated the entire situation yesterday, I think Piper Raquel wasn't happy with how Gavin got himself a new girl, since she allegedly had feelings for him too, at one point. And y'all, this got Piper stuck in a very awkward and embarrassing position since her friends decided to ask her whether she would be down to marry her current boyfriend, Lev. And, um, here's what she had to say. No, we're dating, but this is on a different level. What are you doing? It's I'm not ready my for this. Birthday. It's are not you, for, like, are you trying to like, hint something? No, Look, I it's think for she my wants birthday. to get married. No, I don't want to get married. You don't want to get married to Lev? No, I do. <gasps> She clearly wasn't happy with her relationship with Lev, and the fact that she had to witness Gavin posting about his new girlfriend was probably the hardest thing she ever experienced. Because guess what happened afterward? Yep, Piper Gavin and his new girlfriend Ava decided to film a YouTube video together where Gavin introduced his girlfriend to Piper. And y'all, just take a look at how awkward it was. I had a fun time talking to you, Ava. I had an amazing time. Make sure you guys... <laughs> what? Um, I like meeting you, and I would like to, you know, meet again. We yeah, her acting skills, chef's kiss. After Piper handled the situation very maturely between her, Gavin, and his new girl, things slowly started shifting. People witnessed how Piper and Gavin decided to post TikTok videos of each other on their TikTok accounts. <laughs> Let me 
And y'all, this was the moment where people finally came to the realization that something off was going on. Both Gavin and Piper were spending the majority of their time together while literally being in relationships with other people. After thousands of people started speculating about Piper and Gavin's secret relationship, one of their fans was able to notice in Piper's new video with Gavin that she had a red mark on her belly. And, <laughs> um, this literally started a huge mess on social media since not only did people accuse Gavin of hurting Piper, but some of them even thought that it could have been a hit that Gavin gave her, you guys. I mean, it does seem like a bruise more than a hickey to me. But Gavin did debunk all the sensitive allegations towards him by liking this comment that confirms it was a hickey on Piper's belly. Is it just me or does Piper have a hickey on the side of her stomach? Did he just confirm that he gave Piper a freaking hickey? Love and Ava babies, where are y'all at? It's so funny how I'm making a huge deal out of a hickey when Piper and Gavin did not bother to care about what other people were saying about them since they kissed on live like they didn't just ditch their own partners. Of course. When Piper and Gavin felt comfortable enough to share their relationship on the internet, they continued posting a lot about their relationship since they started going on dates together. And on top of this, y'all, the couple even posted videos of them allegedly kissing each other. Yeah, I'm not sure if this is real or not. But the whole situation didn't stop Piper and Gavin from confusing their fans even more with their relationship after Gavin decided to confess his feelings towards Piper in his newest YouTube video. <laughs> It's obviously a joke. I don't know what you're doing, but this isn't funny and I'm not gonna break up the clip. He even went on TikTok and started liking a bunch of comments confirming that Piper is his crush and they're secretly dating in private. They're definitely dating in private. Is Piper your crush? Uh, yeah. How TF is Piper your crush? But you're dating her. I swear, this is more confusing than my fifth grade math class. At this point, people were just getting tired of Gavin and Piper pretending that them getting back together wasn't really a huge deal. And as a result, some of the Piper squad members decided to leave for good after they felt it was a bit uncomfortable for them to be in a very toxic environment, AKA Piper and her current boyfriend, Gavin. I'm gonna make an entire video on how the Piper squad responded to Piper Raquel getting back with Gavin because it's really messy AF right now and I feel like it needs a separate video for it. But for now, make sure to like and subscribe to help support the channel. Let me know in the comments below your opinion on Piper Raquel and whether you want to see me dragging her in the next video. See y'all next time, bye.